Hey Ice fans, on March 1st, your Cold Lake Ice took on the Saddle Lake Warriors in Game 2 of Round 2 of the NEJBHL playoffs. Tanner Corbiel will start off the ice with a snipe far side to get up 1-0 in the first. And still in the first, Darcy Lockridge goes after Tyson Maton of the Saddle Lake Warriors here in what proved to just be an unusual scrap where Lockridge would get kicked out of the game, but Matten would stay. Second period now. And it would be Tanner Corbeil creating a turnover which would spring Connor Finn down the wing. Finn cuts back towards the net and gets it 5-hole on Dylan Labucan to give the ice the 2-0 lead. Zach Sylvester would then get the puck free out of a scrum along the boards. Christian Nypar would fight along into the Warriors zone and Sylvester would pot the goal 3-0 for the ice. Dallas Desjolais would respond single-handedly as he nets one there. And then a few moments later... The puck would take a weird bounce off Zach Sylvester and Desjolais would knock it down and get it into the back of the net. 3-2 for the ice at this point, but it wouldn't last long as Dallas Ansel busts up the wing, feeds it back to Devin Haskarl who gets it right back to him and Ansel snipes. 4-2 going into the third period. And in the third period, Dallas Ansel would pick up another goal as he gets it through traffic past Dylan Labucan. The ice are up 5-2 at this point. With three minutes left in the game, Kevin Kring Tech Tack would end up picking up the puck and getting the Warriors' last goal of the night. And then moments later, it would be Connor Finn getting the last goal for the ice in this one as he busts down the wing similar to his other goal, and the ice would pick up the 6-3 win. The ice play in Saddle Lake on Monday. Make sure if you can make it out to make it down to Saddle Lake for Game 3 of Round 2 of the NEAJBHL playoffs.